Jake McCarthy is determined to be with the Diamondbacks this season, coming off an oblique injury that held him out of the postseason last year. The Scranton native is once again at 100% and ready for spring training in Arizona. Yeah, you know, and just always just help the team in, in whatever form that that may look like. You know, um, you know, obviously there's a lot of things you can do, a lot of ways to impact the game as as an outfielder. So, uh, you know, you got to control what you can control. But you know, the best version of myself is is all I'm trying to be. The New York Mets claimed Max Kranick off waivers from the Pirates in the offseason, and now the right-handed pitcher from Valley View High School has a new opportunity, being on the 40-man roster in the Big Apple. Yeah, it was great. You know, I made a ton of great relationships there. You know, they gave me an opportunity. You know, wish I was healthier and you know, did more in the last two years, but it's part of the business and looking forward to this next opportunity. Moving on to the Mets now, they obviously claimed you off waivers. You got to be excited about that. I'm thrilled. Yeah, I'm thrilled. A dream come true, really. Growing up a Mets fan, um, just anxious to get down there. And Mason Black, also from Valley View High School and Lehigh University, named the San Francisco Giants 2023 Minor League Pitcher of the Year between AA Richmond and AAA Sacramento. Black recording a 3.79 ERA with 151 strikeouts in 118 innings of work. Black has been working out in Philadelphia and has a shot to be part of the Giants rotation soon. Black is the 10th best prospect right behind Reggie Crawford from North Schuylkill High School and the University of Connecticut. The Super